what is going on guys welcome back to another video so i'm on my way to go check on the biosafety cabinet uh, so wish me luck hopefully it's in good conditions uh, hopefully they let me uh, turn it on and see if everything works fine and hopefully i find a way to get it out of the building so we'll see So I need to check on the, um, I saw that. If it has any serial number or anything, so I can just maybe do some more research uh, online. Oh, here it is. Okay. Yes. Yeah, it's okay. Um, so it is, it is very tall. Okay. Um, it's about the same size. I see. Let me see if I can find this. Why do I need, okay, so this. On the back, that's how it connects. Mm -hmm. uh, what about that that drain in there? This. Yes. So I mean, it's still connected, but I see that is well, it's just that's the drain over there. So it's not technically connected to anything. Okay. Um, what is this for? Drain for? Okay, I see. What is that for? Plenium drain. I'll have to do some a bit of research on that. Okay, it looks good. Uh, UV light, okay. Mm -hmm. Looks very good. It has been discontaminated. Gosh, ultraviolet. Uh, the, do they have the, bio, the UV light works? Yes. It yes, does. everything works. Perfect. It's very nice. So it is a vertical. Uh, uh, lamina flow cool, right? Yes. Yeah. Vertical and then exhaust. Very nice. Does it have any fluorescent? Oh, here it is. Fluorescent lights, okay. Does this come, come, come down? Uh-huh. It's a little. Car, oh, it's okay. It's okay. Do you know how, how low does it get? Or it gets all the way down? I think it'll go all the way down. Uh, we get it to about right here. Okay. Um, it's okay. It's okay. Um, alrighty. Still gonna see. Very nice cabinet. Uh, I'll have to do some research to see if I can find the the total weight of it. So because it would take it would take some people to, to get it out, and it would take. No, I have one. I have a four foot, um, which is a lot smaller. It's four hundred and fifty pounds. So it takes four people to lift that, that one up. Uh, this one is probably around the 700, 800 pounds. Yeah. yeah well, so it would probably take six. Oh, this, uh, yeah. This okay, so this is plastic. Okay, at least at least this one has some, some grip in here. It's flat, so that's good because mine has an edge and it just is very sharp. It's very oh. difficult to have a grab. Uh -huh. um, okay. Measure the door. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm already, I'm already on, on that. So, do you measure from here to there, or do you measure all the way from the, on the here? I can measure here. Oh, okay. Um, I can measure. Do you there. have any? Yeah, yeah. That would be that would be great. What do you think, guys? It's pretty good. It's pretty good, but also looks pretty massive. It's big. <laughs> it's going to be difficult to get it out of here. They have a bunch of equipment. Really, really nice. Good. Sink. Power. Power. And like I said, I don't. Um, I started filming after I got here, but the lady said that they they actually had the hood, the replacement outside, and they have also replacement because you just have extra money on the ground. So this still works perfectly fine. Yeah, let's take a look. 33, 34, okay. Alright. Let's do. 
But what about here? Does it still make it? Here we can make it. All right, guys. So it is a very nice hood. Um, I don't know if you could hear me when I was there. I'm sorry, my video was probably pretty bad, but I was just inside the hospital. I didn't want to, to be too obvious, but Lamina Flow Hood looks very nice. Um, they got some money. Um, they got a grant money and that's why they are replacing the hood. The, flu, the, the hood still works. It's in perfect condition, it still works. So, I mean, the, the most difficult part will be to get it out. Uh, it's going to be really heavy. It's going to take me, I will have to see if I can find um, five or six people used to, to help me out. Um, kind of the most difficult part will be uh, that they are open from 8.30 to 4.30, Monday to Friday. So I'm available, but trying to find people available at that time, that's going to be the most difficult part. So, I mean, wish me luck. I will see if I can, can beat and see if I can win it. And I mean, stay tuned, check on the next video and see if I, if I bought it. And if I bought it, we'll see how, how we get it out and how we get it into the lab. I mean, it's not going to be on the lab, but uh, I will make a space somehow. It's a very nice lab. And I think it's a really nice opportunity for me used to, to be able to get it. So even if I had to pay dinner for eight people, uh, I think it's worth it. Uh, so we'll see. Uh, stay tuned and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye. Hey everyone. Thanks for watching the video. If you're enjoying these Tissue Culture videos, be sure to follow us on social media for more informative content. And if you're interested in conducting your own tissue culture experiments, make sure to check us out at plancelltechnology.com for all the products you need to get started. Use the code FP10 for 10% off your first purchase.